for That's sure. That's very surprising, actually. Mm -hmm. But yeah, as you guys Damn. already saw there, Yoshi and Sheik and Sonic Ike. Damn. And it looks like they're about to start it off. All right. They're going... We are going Smash Bros? Yeah. The classic. <laughs> Okay. All right. Yeah, I was expecting Seal and AK to switch roles, mostly because Seal is such a very aggressive Yoshi. Mm -hmm. So that's most likely going to be expected. And Blitz yeah. is usually the support type, and Raijin more so the aggressive. He mm -hmm. hates usually being the defensive, but if he has to, he has to. Yeah, yeah well, of course. But right now, Seal with the most damage. However, AK being the healthiest. I noticed already it seems like they're kind of uh, separating themselves. Yeah, they're definitely taking it to two separate 1v1s. Mm -hmm. Which is never what you want to do in doubles. Lots of F smashes from Fred. Right. Interesting. Oh, another one. I feel like he might be misbuffering those for F kills. Maybe. So uh, F smash is like reasonably safe for Sonic. Oh, oh my god, that oh, both of them. Jeez. Alright. Um definitely a neutral trade there, more so because accidentally hit his partner, but also took out Seal as well. Yeah, so not the best. Or the worst thing that can happen. The only problem is that AK only at 43% and that's his main role as uh, doubles. He usually just plays the support type and lets Seal go in. Oh, Ooh, okay. geez, that's it. Able to shield that up smash, but yeah. lack of communication by the blue team again. It definitely seems like AK is playing it very reserved. He's not always taking risks. He's just sitting back and charging needles. And these guys have teamed quite a bit before, so AK does know how Seal works with his aggressive team. All right, Green pulls into the lead. Okay, Green dash tag. Rope up smash by <laughs> up smash. Blitz. But that's definitely what he's known for in the Ontario suit. <laughs> the eruption too, oh my goodness. He's going for everything. I, I think he's too used to the, the things he did not speak about. Yeah. Okay, a little sandwich. Ooh, that took okay. a stop. Yeah, really? I'm actually surprised I killed, but um... Okay, okay hey, nice, nice. Hatch with the light uh, never mind, it was not nice at all, he killed Spartan. Yeah. Oh jeez. I think if they want to pull together, they gotta stop the team kills. Because what, Blitz has already taken two of Raiden's stocks. Another rope up smash, and Seal is definitely a lot smarter than that, despite like how aggressive he usually is. So. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Nice jab up smash. That was real nice. Okay, oh, oh okay. okay, nice. Barely enough to make it back. With the down smash, that was a really big call there. Okay. okay, hits him with the reverse flare, and that's gonna take Gets the up smash too. Seems like they've got the momentum right now. Oh, Travis is barely up smash. Unfortunately, they're oh, very tight. Oh, nice egg lay. And, okay, okay so no, no, he's got to jump. That's smart. That's the thing, when you pop out of the egg lay, you actually get a little bit of a hop. Mm -hmm. So that way, you're able to actually preserve your jump and make it back. Nice foot school. That, that was, was a sick combo. A conversion there. If they want any chance of winning this, I think they've got to stop letting Sheik do the needle thing and try and take the fight to her. And I feel like Raijin is actually having a harder time dealing with Seal mm -hmm. compared to AK. Oh, Ooh. that's unfortunate. The jab, or the pummel from Sheik actually interrupted. Oh, but he gets the ledge ground. This is definitely not out of question with Rage. Yeah. Okay, getting too antsy. Okay. And that's why I feel like, oh, nice egg snipe. And that's why I feel like if you're ever in the lonesome in the 2v1, I feel like sometimes you want to focus on oh, that's it. the Sheik as well. Like anyone at the lower percent, because mm -hmm. usually they think that you're just going to target a person with a higher percent or like you just kill. Yeah. And then it'll be a 1v1. Mm -hmm. But sometimes you always want to rotate back and forth between the two, just because you want to apply safe pressure and always keep them on tilt. And you definitely have a bigger advantage in the uh, the fear factor when both of the enemies are at high percent, like kill percent, because then it's like you could switch targets on a whim. Yeah. But uh, they definitely could not clutch that one out. That was, um, I wouldn't say completely convincing, but um, it was nice enough yeah. for 
the green team to take that. They really started out in uh, the green team's favor, but yeah. then they kind of, blue team kind of figured it out, but I guess not quick enough. Yeah, I feel like they just need to fix the team attacks, because Bliss did kill mm -hmm. Raijin twice. And to be fair, AK is, I feel, is the main issue they need to focus on, because he's just sitting back and being a really good support. So I feel you need to pressure him a bit more and not give him enough room to just do whatever he wants and let exactly. Seal be on the aggressive. I can see Raja switching to Cloud just because more so more so dealing with Yoshi. Yeah. But uh, no, they're sticking with it and going to right, Battlefield. Battlefield. I feel like with the Sheik problem, this isn't really the best pick. Yeah, safe pressure for Sheik and a lot of pressure for Yoshi now this time compared to Sonic and Sonic and Ike. The only thing that really benefits them is that they can live a little bit longer. Mm -hmm. But same goes for Yoshi. But he has the better kill power, I feel. Exactly. Unless Sonic gets the grabs. Yeah. In which case, okay. <laughs> Let's go for the classic blitz. Too hard of an F smash read. But, you know, they do have the lead. Okay, that was nice awareness by Ryzen saying, let get this dash tap, I'll shield it. Let's go for a lot of smashes. Ooh, Ooh that there? Oh, my down God. air. Not the sweet spot, but. You don't have to take it. Yeah. I, I do feel like the blue team still, when uh, their partner's getting kind of comboed and pressured, they're not really switching focus. Yeah, they're still, um, whatever's like in their range, they're more so focusing on that. Mm -hmm. But Raijin actually, definitely uh, telling us to stop popping. Yeah. <laughs> really good awareness there. See, so they're, they're splitting up again, which isn't really uh, rewarding them. Yeah. But they do have the lead, so I mean, I guess they can do what they want. At this point, yeah, Raj is doing a much better job. Basically, switch places with AK in terms of being the better support type. Wow, that F smash, yeah. Seal trying to challenge that F smash and did not get the best result. Blitz landing with a lot of corruption. <laughs> he needs to realize this is a different game. <laughs> yeah, that is for sure. We don't play illegal games here. Yeah, Foy there, but Raj will still be living. So yet again, Sheik is the stock holder, but Raj is doing an equally good job in holding stocks. Oh. As we say that. My yeah. bad. <laughs> even then, oh, stocks nice are Trump. even, and if they kill AK somehow, it's going to be conditional in their favor. Mm -hmm. Raj looking for the grab. I mean, all they need is a grab at this point. Okay, he's back in the corner with the needles. Okay, nice play shoot by AK. Going very deep. All of these smash attacks. I mean, one of them is bound to hit, but still not the safest option. Oh, oh boy, team there. kill? No. Not yet. Oh, okay, nice, nice read. Smash. And this is definitely much more convincing for the blue team. Oh, oh Seal he goes too low. A whole two stocks ahead. I feel like Seal definitely isn't pulling his weight this time around. Oh, they're getting it started. All right, this is the 2v1 combos I was talking about that they need. Okay, nice coverage by Seal there, covering his partner. And I have no idea what that arrested is from Blitz. This is definitely questionable. Oh my god, the full charge. Doesn't even get punished for it. All right, gets the second one. Okay, Blitz recovering, huh? Smart. Sheik back in the corner with the needles. Is he dead? Just barely makes it. Okay, that was a nice 2v1 combo by the green team. Oh, twice. Oh, nice. Blue team definitely stepping up synergy here. It's a raw F smash. AK in trouble. Okay, good there, though. Yeah. Can't kill off that. Ground pound gonna take it. I definitely feel like you should have waited a second there. Uh, yeah. Tether definitely could have set up for an up smash and killed. Agreed. And now Blitz getting a little bit too anti here. Seems like they back throw. That was definitely an interesting choice by Blitz. Oh, and the spring stage spike. Ooh. Now it's a 2v1. Yep. He's got to take three stocks if he wants to pull this back. That's the thing. Um, uh, I, I, I could say it's doable. 
due to the fact that Yoshi has good aerial momentum and good mix-ups, especially with the egg lay. But no, unfortunately, unfortunately. yeah, that's going to be too hard for Seal to overcome. That was definitely much more convincing than the first game for the blue team. However, uh, green team still has the counter pixel. We'll see what happens here. I feel like um, the platforms definitely put in the work for Blitz and Raijin. Mm -hmm. So I'm probably going to say they want something like maybe FD or Duck Hunt. I think that'd be a smart pick. That way, green team has extra recovery as well as they could sort of get a little bit of camouflage with the bushes as well. Exactly. But I feel like they're... Uh kind of a uh, needle game where they just sit back and they let AK hold stocks. It wasn't really working out for them too much there, yeah. despite the platform coverage. So yeah, I felt like in that set, uh, blue team was a little bit adapted, as well as they were getting the stocks really early on Seal, mm -hmm. which made it go downhill for them. Yeah. So I feel if Seal's able to change his aggressiveness style, mm -hmm. then they should be able to clutch it out. But this definitely could go either way yeah. with how those matches went. This is definitely a really close. Definitely one of the, like, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, balanced, like, middle seeds, mm -hmm. so to speak. Definitely. Are they going Duck Hunt? That'd be the smart pick. That uh, definitely would be. But uh, I'm not sure what they banned. Could they anyway? I feel like they either would have banned FD or or Duck Hunt, to be honest. Okay, mm -hmm. they're still discussing, so they're definitely putting thought in this pick. They do not want their winner's bracket life to end. Yeah. That would be an okay pick. Yoshi's up smash kills pretty early, but at the same time, Ike's up yeah, smash. Yeah, Ike as well. I feel like it's depending on who's able to get the better conversion. So whoever gets like the grab combo, like Cheeks though is also leading to a lot of Yoshi's stuff as well. That's so. true. But uh, I definitely feel like Blitz and Raijin have been getting the better follow-ups. Yeah. The stray hit game by Green Team hasn't really been working. They really need to maximize their combos. Speaking of maximizing, AK already at 47%. Oh, and the lock, but. Okay, Raijin actually able to get a uh, compensation for damage there. Mm -hmm. And I just kind of noticed that it seems like with Seal's aggression, he's separating himself from his partner and kind of splitting them up. Oh, oh, that F smash. Run past him and get the F smash. It didn't kill, but it certainly sent a message. Yeah. And that's the thing with Bliss. If he's able to connect any of those, he'll, he'll keep going for it. <laughs> he's definitely a swimmer. Surprise! He, whenever uh, Raijin down throws, he's going for aerials instead of smashes. Maybe yeah. an aerial cover the tech option. Ooh. Oh, if he had up aired there. Clutch air dodge. Oh. Okay. They both charge an up smash. Yeah, both guys definitely trying to. That's the team the synergy right there. A good tech. Okay. See, yeah, this is where the blue team struggled in the past. They couldn't really get the kills out. And as I say yeah. that again. Needle leading into that back. Unfortunate back there. And yeah, I feel Seals just being a little bit. He's, he's approaching recklessly. Mm -hmm. So that's why he's eating a lot of damage here. And when he approaches uh, in an improper way, he definitely leaves his partner hanging. Yeah. And, and I this, feel this is doubles. You can't leave your partner behind. Okay, up smash, but not gonna be enough to take out Sonic. Up throw, yeah. Ooh, man. Gotta tell me with the up smash. <laughs> two <laughs> zero for two right now. Oh, Ooh, nice tech. tech. Oh wow, he actually got a uh, up the edge cancel on the buff one. Oh, he read the roll, but just waited too long. Yeah, Seal getting way too antsy, and if he did get that up smash, it definitely would not be killing Ike right now. So no way. to just play it cool and. I feel like he needs egg lay. I feel egg lay is definitely a good mix-up option, especially when blue team is shielding a lot. Mm -hmm. And like the uh, when they break out of the egg. Oh, there's I one swear you heard me. There's no <laughs> way. A lot of 
just random smash attacks. I feel like if they just play, you know, more team based, go for maybe grab combos with each other, they definitely have a, an easier time closing out the stocks. Because right now it's just a 1v1 and Seal not noticing that AK is in trouble. And they also need those grab combos because it leads into a lot, especially with Yoshi. Yeah, and she, like, her move set up perfectly for Yoshi. Okay, good up smash. Okay, up smash. Takes the first Finally stock. gonna okay, oh, there we go. Alright, even stocks, but seal definitely at 111. Oh good follow up. Yeah, Blitz getting the roll read, getting a nice back uh back throw into Sonic back there. It goes to the up there, it doesn't connect. Oh, it's gonna be a lot that of damage. That was big damage. Uh, they're gonna need more than that to bring it back here. Yeah. So he keeps getting the dares. All right, going for pressure. See, this is more smart pressure. He's just pressuring the shield instead of rushing in blindly. Oh, breaks, breaks the shield. shield. Blitz should be able to save him. Yeah. Yeah. To be honest, I'm sort of surprised AK just stood there and didn't occupy Blitz, especially mm -hmm. with the needles. While that's but he definitely would have gave Seal the option to go for at least like a 25% damage down air. It was also unfortunate. He landed on the platform, which kind of made it awkward to punish. Yeah. Separating himself. Again. Yeah, it keeps happening. He's too focused on the Sonic. Trying to wall him out, but it's not really prevailing with that. Okay, the back throw. Oh, no. I mean, they haven't really been getting any edge guards. Yeah, so I feel. I feel. Seal, oh, he's dead. Yeah. I, I feel so. green team is too focused on the one v one mindset, mm -hmm. whereas blue team. They're doing the 1v1 as well, but if they see a chance, they'll they'll turn into a 2v1 scenario. Exactly. Oh, the reverse reverse F-Smash. He's living. Goes for, okay, goes for another roll read. <laughs> Relax, Blitz. Almost got that one. We uh, definitely that need a counter for this. There okay, there we go. <laughs> we <laughs> definitely need a Blitz Smash counter. That's <laughs> yeah. for sure. What started out is really convincing for the green team. Definitely turned in Blitz and Rajit's favor. Yeah. Yeah, as soon as game two happened, they definitely stepped up the synergy, discussed what they went wrong, and okay, hell dude, definitely uh, interrupt me as I <laughs> was complimenting the set, but either way, I will be stepping out right now.